Kendall James Hawker IV. I retired as a machinist mate first class, surface warfare. They sent me to the USS Bainbridge. And I got on board it and I was not impressed. It was not what I'd come to expect for a naval ship. The, uh, well, I hate to talk bad about it, but let's just say that it was not up to the standards I was used to. The USS Bainbridge was a uh, another cruiser <clears throat> guided missile, nuclear powered. It was an older design than in the Mississippi. It was an older vessel. It uh, was a good stout ship, and we did what we had to do with it. We uh, frequently had spent a lot of time cleaning and upkeep and maintenance. Did a full set of workups on it, took it on the Mediterranean deployment as part of a Stanaf Forland deployment, which is the NATO deployment. We were in the uh, Adriatic Sea for that, earning us all the uh, NATO medal. Life on the Bainbridge, we had a good crew. We had a fantastic crew for that deployment. We had Captain J.M. Brown with us, and he was the best captain I've ever sailed under. He thought of his people. He took care of his people. If it was not right for his people, he made it right if he could. If not, somebody was going to pay for it. Uh, he held us all to a higher standard than other places I had been. And if it wasn't up to his standard, you made it up to his standard. That's pretty much it. But he did lead from the front. Came back, made one or two little cruises, and then took it in the yard for defueling, decommissioning. 